Okay, today is this time, and it's uh, the 8th of September, uh, 2013. And this here is the uh, 194 that I've been having issues with. It won't stay on. Okay, and this here is a regular incandescent uh, 3157. This is a 3157 LED standard headlight. Okay, then, and it's off. And here we have a regular set of headlights and bulbs with the other uh, that I'm having an issue with, okay? Now, let's go here, see if I can do this right. So now, there's the mileage, okay? And the radio works, okay great. So now, what I want to show is that how this side here hyper flashes, oh let me turn the parking lights on, that's the whole issue here, wait, turn that off. Okay, parking lights are on, okay? So now I'm gonna turn the hyper flash on so you can see which side is hyper flashing and LED and all that, okay? So here we go, we got the really bright light there and then the parking lights are on. And then we've got the hyper flash and the other one here is on as well, okay? Now, what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna show you briefly as a standard flash right there ding 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 with the radio on okay all right and again that's what's supposed to flash this is not supposed to flash okay i'm not going to go there all right so now turn the radio down all right turn that off no more blinker so now a long time ago a long time ago i got these here from China for 13 days. And these are the ones that are currently on right now and running. And I've got these here from DT Auto Tech. These are the ones I'm going to install change. Okay? So here we go. I'm only going to change one bulb. And you know how that works. You gotta untick these out. Alright. Take these out. And because these are polarity. And here, this is why I have it out. I'm thinking about it, let me show you if I can show you. Well, that's kind of hard to show, but that's that's the size difference of them, okay? So there you go, that's the size difference of them, like that. And uh, these are polarized, so you have to put them in either one way to work the first time, or it won't work the first time, but let's see, there we go. It lights that way, and it doesn't light that way. Great. Put them in this way, and hopefully you can see how much, how... I guess a little bit less brighter than these are than the other side. But now, okay, so now what is it? About three minutes into this, I just plug these in. The other one's been on for, I don't know. So now the whole idea here is this is going to be like about a 10 minute video. If you want to see how long it takes for the driver's side to start. I don't know what she's yammering about, but let's see how long it takes for this side here, the driver's, I mean the passenger side, to start flashing versus this other one here that should not flash. Let's see if I got this in the thing here. Oops. Yeah. Like that. Can we see this one here? It is. Hopefully this shows up well on the camera, I can't tell, but like I said, the one on the passenger side should not, should, uh, the one on the driver's side should not flicker, whereas the one on the passenger side is the one that I'm having the issue with, that it uh, turns off. So when the first, when the passenger side turns off, the other one shouldn't, but we'll take this about, let's just see how long it stays on. Hopefully the one on the driver's side will not flash like the one on the passenger side has been flashing in the previous three videos that I've made concerning this issue here. And I would have shot this in the earlier morning, but just can't do everything really up oh, there when it just went out 
So that one went out. Hopefully we can see. Yeah, it went on. Okay, so great. So we can see that coming on. And uh, I don't know if I hold up something dark behind this. Illuminate. Yeah, it went off again, yay. <laughs> it's not supposed to do that, right? It's just a, not a flashing light, it's just a regular standard on light. But the other one, the driver's side is still on. So that's great. Doing what I'm supposed to be doing. And it's fairly bright. It's not as bright as allegedly as the other side is, but it's brighter than our standard incandescent. It's going off again. So where are we? Six minutes. Okay. Take it to eight minutes and we'll call it a day. How about that? Just come on and the one over there is just still on as you can see all right hmm. and that noise you hear in the background there's an air conditioning uh, condenser fan that needs new bearings just in case you're wondering what that noise is back there so how are we doing when I roll up to eight minutes, we'll shut this thing off and call it a day. <clears throat> hmm. That's and it's not supposed to go off. The other one didn't go off. This one stayed on the whole time. This other one here is flashing off. Come back on again. That's how we did on time. Again. <laughs> well, here, while it's off, we'll just give it a quick glance as to what it looks like when it's off. It's not supposed to be off, but it is off. And back on again. Yay, who? Okay. And there is the regular part running, uh, you know, lights like that. And over here are these. And we'll just finish up with that one's how, how bright that one is there. That's all I know. Today, this one stayed on the whole time while the other one's been flashing on and off, which is a uh, bad one, I get a bad pair. But anyway, there we go. That's my review of this uh, synetic lights versus yellow. Thanks for day. Bye-bye.